I mean, it just shows a lot of heart, a lot of character that he, that he has. Um, for him to just come in with the confidence level that he does have, and we all have confidence in him. And for him to perform the way he did is big time. So we just keep our confidence in him. Hopefully he can keep doing it. Uh, we just played our game, really. I mean, I think the defensive end really helped us a lot. I mean, we pressured them. Mm -hmm. We felt like if we get a uh, – actually, our goal was to get 36 deflections. We've been talking about that all week. I mean, as long as we put pressure on the ball, I mean, we felt like we could get them out of rhythm, and that's what we did. I mean, it, it paid off for us. Is it a little bit different mindset coming in here? I mean, it seemed like there was a little bit of confidence right from the start. Yeah, um, we felt like – I mean, of course, we feel like we can play with anybody. We can beat anybody. Mm -hmm. uh, as long as we play hard on the defensive end and play together on the defensive end, we feel like we can beat anybody. So uh, we was able to get that done today, and uh, we got the win. What's your first thoughts on Aaron Kraft for Sunday? <laughs> uh, he, it's going to be tough. I mean, he plays a lot of good defense. But, um, I mean, I'm just going to come out here and play my game and hopefully do good and get the win. I still believe that we're the best team out there. I feel like everybody in this locker room does. Uh, like you said, when we get stops and score the ball, we're a dangerous team. Uh, I think our, our post game um, is something that gets underrated. You know, we have great post players. You know, George is one of them. You know, uh, you know, we're able to exploit them inside and, and, um, and really, you know, uh, it came a lot from you know them having to respect us as, as jump shooters, and um, you know that opened up the lane, and I really you know their bigs were not as uh, you know, we're not able to cover us as well. So you know we got easy buckets and easy dunks, and we we're able to really you know, really use that for advantage. Yeah, you know I felt like in those first couple you know first couple minutes I couldn't buy a bucket, and you know it's. Uh, it always, always sucks as a player when you, you know, you feel like you have easy layups and you're just missing them. But you know, I just, you know, my guys on my team, you know, really helped me keep my confidence up. I just really kept attacking, and you know, I kind of forgot about that missed dunk and just kind of tried to get some more. I, I know some comments were said in their interviews that uh, uh, some stuff that, that we didn't appreciate, and uh, they were sort of calling out me and Melvin and how we, we can't guard them. And I know uh, a couple things on Twitter, but I mean. What have me and Melvin done? I mean, we, we've played against bigger guys the whole year. Uh, so this is nothing new to us. Uh, so we felt like our, our backs weren't up against the wall. We just had felt like we just had to bring our lunch pail and go to work again. It's another day. Uh, I don't know. I just uh, another thing in the game. I mean, you can say I trash talk and... Uh, it's, it's all fun and games, you know, basketball is a great game and sometimes that gets me in trouble with the refs, but uh, today it didn't. And um, I don't know, I think I've just had a chip on my shoulder my whole life being doubted. And then again, I heard comments, be, me being doubted, I couldn't handle coolly this and that and the other. So, I mean, th that motivates you at some point. So I'm, I'm happy we came out the win and, and our team played great.